This wide-eyed baseball fan is quickly committing all the legend's names to memory. Andrew started collecting baseball cards about a year ago, and with the help of his father, Mark, he's already amassed more than 800. This weekend at the Hall of Fame One convention, that number is growing. And salesmen wanting to add to his collection, as well as to their own pocketbooks, were quick to try to make friends with the shopper. Thanks, everybody. Give him a big hand. Today's this young man's it's birthday. It's his birthday. Come on. Come on, everybody. All right. All right. Yeah. Your, your dad said he was going to spend $1,000 on you today. No. $500. $2,000. He's just lucky to have you. Birthday boy. Okay, Dad, take your pick. The prices are on the back. I couldn't let the day go by without getting Andrew some Cub paraphernalia, even if it only cost me 75 cents. Thank you. Here you go, Andrew. Here's a little Ryan Sandberg button for you for your birthday, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. By noon today, Mark had already spent $75 on Andrew, but all the coveted items in this crowded baseball card show couldn't equal the priceless possession that Andrew planned to leave here with today. What are you doing here on your birthday? How come you came here instead of going to the movies or something? Well, I'll get Andy Pascal's autograph. With so many Hall of Famers here signing balls and photos, why was Andrew so intent on getting this man's signature? Well, we were here yesterday and we saw that uh, Andy Pafka was going to be here today, and he was my favorite when I was a boy, so he decided that we ought to come back again today. So Is that true are. that you named Andrew after him? Yeah, that's, he was my favorite player, and that's how he got his first name. So for Andrew, the highlight of the weekend was not in the cards, but in the real thing. What are you doing there, buddy? Your name Andy, too? Yeah. He's named after you. I was one of your fans when I left Chicago. Very good. Nice to see you. Not many people get to meet their namesake and sports hero on the same day, especially on their birthday. But for Andrew, this eighth birthday was a double header. Marilee Joyce, 27, Eyewitness News Weekend reports. My, what a birthday and a nice day for it. And tomorrow is another one.